Hi everyone, my name is Mong Chen Kao. I'm the student assistant of Museum of Zoology in National Taiwan University. Today is my grand honor to share a story about the newest exhibition in our museum. In November 2022, which called Three Brothers of Flying Squirrels and Their Microbiome Friends. That exhibition is entirely curated by students. Why we do that? It's not only because we want to provide students more opportunities in order to develop their abilities. We can also learn from younger generations to explore new ideas. We summarize how we create this exhibition with students into five steps. Here we are going to share in step by step. First, the exhibition topic from NTUMD curator and members of researcher lab. In order to choose a topic which is close to recently researched, we find exhibition topic from recently academic resource, providing from biological researcher in NTUMD. For example, the newest exhibition referred to this paper is published in scientific report. Secondly, we ask students to put forward several proposals about how to make an exhibition based on the topic we found. Students in NTU need to reorganize the professional information into a public friendly story. To make the learning process more fun, students try to use various interactive media such as puzzles, videos, tables, and voting to display the exhibition content. Like in figure one, it's showing puzzle games about the knowledge in ecological of flying squirrels. Certainly, cooperation between students is really important. We believe unity is strength. We encourage students in NTU to create the exhibition content and students from Chinese Culture University produce graphic design for this exhibition. As you can see in the PowerPoint, the evolving version of the graphic design. This changing is based on several discussion between students. Our museum as a consultant accompany the whole process with students to create exhibition. Fourthly, Article for a general public. In order to make content easier to understand, NTUMZ invites students and PhD researcher to write article for the general public. Try to discuss the scientific finding and sharing their experience of curating exhibit. Lastly, offline and online exhibition and collected feedback from visitor. Due to the pandemic shock of COVID-19, we need to transform our exhibition into hybrid one, including online and offline. Thus, we modify it into an online exhibition built as a role-playing game in Gazatown website. As a visitor, you can create a character and explore our exhibition room whenever and wherever you want. The exhibition opened on February 19th, 2022, and the opening ceremony was held on the site at NTUMZ and online on Facebook in a hybrid format. Moreover, in order to improve the future exhibition, we asked the feedback from the visitor, the gender and the different age, and why they visit this exhibition. It's in the following such as attendance to school activity and like exhibition are the two main reasons they visit this exhibition. To sum up, this is a whole process to create a new exhibition with students. It's always excited to create a new things with others, especially whenever in a group fulfilled with the process and consequence. We believe we can keep this passion and energy in future. Feel free to contact us if you have anything you want to share with us. Thank you.